Burmese military oppresses Rohingyas to the maximum, where the locals are forced to flee from their villages to nearby places, making them internally displaced, complains a suffering Rohingya on 5th May 2017. In a continuous persecution and torture, Burmese military have threatened Rohingyas to such an extent where they are forced to be displaced. Moreover, the locals fear of creating concentrated camps like IDPs by government, which they did in the 2012 state-sponsored violence in Akyap and latest 2016's so-called clearance operation in northern Mongdo. Now, this new wave of threat and fear have victimized the villagers of Sofarang, Tongbaza and Tangana villages of Butidong Township. Later, a local explains, if these oppressions and crime against humanity continues, there will be no Rohingya left in their own ancestral land and the Burmese military's master plan of genocide will be fully successful. Burmese military, immigration and BGP stationed differently and arbitrarily tortured Rohingya severely in Bolibaza Gate, where another innocent Rohingya was arrested in Butidong on 3rd June 2017. In the incidents in Mongdo, military, immigration and BGP stationed on the road of Bolibaza Main Gate at three different distances, where every passing Rohingya had to go through three different checkpoints. Moreover, after checking, every pedestrian was tortured inhumanely by all three departments with different unjust excuses like way of dressing, walking, among others. Now locals are in extreme fear of the authorities and their inhumane tortures. In another separate incident in Butidong, Sarafa arrested a local Rohingya shop owner with a false accusation of providing training and financial support to the armed group in the region. According to the locals, victim Haji Islam is a simple shop owner and now is in incommunicado from family since the arrest by the Sarafa. Burmese authorities' brutal incidences have created an ambience of threat in the region and are in extreme starving situation due to the unemployment and destruction in Cyclone Mora.